Hey, what's up folks? In this project, we're making a candy dispensing prop for Halloween. For social distant trick-or-treating, we thought we'd make a BLE controlled servo claw using the Circuit Playground Blue Fruit. We put our project on this flying ghost prop that we got from our local Halloween shop. It moves up and down along a rope that's strung across our porch. The servo is triggered using our phone with the Blue Fruit Connect app. This is a 3D printed claw gripper that we designed to hold a small bag of candy. We think this is a fun way to give out candy that could be adapted for all sorts of projects. The BLE libraries for CircuitPython make it easy to control servos using the Blue Fruit Connect app. In the code, the up and down buttons are set to trigger the servo when they're pressed. The angle of the servo is tuned for the gripper so it doesn't stress out the motor. In the Blue Fruit app, you can press the up and down buttons to open and close the gripper. We think this is a quick and easy way to make a BLE controlled servo project. You can get the parts to build this project, links are in the description. The parts can be 3D printed in PLA filament without any support material. You'll need these hardware screws to secure the parts together for building the servo claw. To make the assembly small and compact, we like using these 3 pin Pico connectors. One of the cables is wired up to the pads on the Circuit Playground Blue Fruit. We shortened the cable on the servo and wired it up to the other cable. Be sure to check out the learn guide for a full tutorial on assembling this project. The servo is press fitted into this holder with the shaft fitted through the opening. The arm of the claw is fitted over the shaft and secured to one of the servo arms. The other arm is secured to the mounting hole using an M3 screw and hex nut. The top cover of the case is secured to the servo holder using machine screws. The Circuit Playground Blue Fruit sits in the enclosure with the wires fitted through the hole in the cover. The servo can then be plugged into the Circuit Playground Blue Fruit. The top cover is secured to the enclosure using additional machine screws. We had to adjust the placement of the servo hoard to avoid stressing out the motor. The enclosure is secured to the battery cover of the Flying Ghost using double-sided phone tape. We had a lot of fun putting this together and hope it inspires you to make projects with social distancing. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more projects from Adafruit.